Hello everybody and welcome back to the SAS channel. It's time for Fulham versus Liverpool. And well, I'm just watching a bit of the Manchester United game beforehand. But yeah, the big one for us anyway, Fulham versus Liverpool, that is going to kick off in about 25 minutes or so. And well, yeah, let's see. Let's see if there's been any improvements. As you can see, there's been some serious changes to the lineup, which, yeah, much needed because there's no point in keep playing the same players who aren't performing. You know, wasn't it Einstein who described insanity as doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result? So that was, that's what Liverpool seem to be doing at the moment, doing the same thing over and over and expecting the results to change, and they're not changing. Oh, Gakpo does well, get a foot in there and wins the ball high up. He's now running at the defence. Oh, he's just about pass it to Jota. Jota gets taken out again. Another free kick. Same position, same player. Polina. This time it's to the left of the goal instead of the right. Much more suited for Trent to take a shot this time, hopefully. But silly position to pick a see in the free kick. Jota, he's just, he's just throwing himself in there, Polina. Yeah, Trent's definitely going for this one, I reckon. Gakpo's being pushed all over the place by Pereira. Trent. Oh, what a goal! You should have let him take the first one. Trent from the free kick, top bins. Top left. 1-0. Finally, what a goal, Trent. Why has he let Elliot take the first one if he's going to do something like that? <laughs> oh, it's top bins. It's top bins. It's the top of the top bins. It's just perfect. Up and over the wall. Curls down, goalkeeper. Goalkeeper needs to jump another yard to touch that. But Fulham have won it back anyway. Polina, Robinson with the cross in. Oh, just going to give a penalty, is he? No, here it is, though. There it is, 1-1. One, one. It is just a load of shit happening in the box there. Liverpool can't do anything with it. And I'm not sure who's the one who scored it. And this is Liverpool back to their, you know, their best. So, it's on the left-hand side, right? Cross comes in. It goes all the way through to Awobi. Awobi then passes it back in. Moon is with the shot. And it's blocked. And then who is it? Is it Castagna, is it? Comes onto it. Yeah, he's just come onto it. He's just side-footed it into the bottom left-hand corner. He's taking that goal really well, actually. Yeah, it's Castagna. And that's the way that happens. And that's a That's just the way it is watching Liverpool these days. Van Dyke now and Kwanzaa. Yeah, I know the likes of Granberg and Elliot are supposed to be carrying the ball and making that, but they can't keep carrying it. Elliot now with a ball to Gakpo. Oh, his touch is just too heavy. Does well to take it out of the air, but can't quite control it. Elliot with the interception now. Elliot into Gravenberg. Gravenberg with a shot. Yes! Get it down, you Gravenberg. Have that. That's what he can do. What a shot that is. Wow. 
What a shot that is. Fair play to him. Delighted for him. So, yeah, it is a sloppy pass. Gary, I was just saying. Elliot cuts it out, feeds it into Gravenboat, edge of the penalty area, gets it out of his foot with a touch, and then curls it. It's another cracking goal against Fulham. It's very similar to the goal Endo scored against Fulham in the last, in the last game back in December. So, who's he going to bring off, though, for them? I mean, Endo probably for McAllister. I mean, is he going to bring Gakpo off? Gakpo's had a brilliant game. Oh, Gakpo, here we go. He's still going. Feeds it through to Jota properly this time. Go on, Jota. Yes! 3-1! Is he offside? I think he might have been a little bit offside. But finally, Jota! Gakpo finds... There's enough space for Gakpo to feed that ball through to Jota on that run. Slides it through. Jota takes a touch. Kicks it through to goalkeeper. I, th I, think he, I think his toes are offside. His toes on his right foot are offside, I think. Oh! It's onside! That must be by a whisker. That must be by a toenail. That's been given as onside. But uh, yeah, that's going to be it for me, guys. I am going to be live again on Wednesday the 24th. That's going to be Everton um, away. That's going to be at Goodison Park. Um, Kickoff is at 8 o'clock, so I'll be live from about half past 7 that evening, um, like usual, just a little bit before the game. Um, and I just want to say a massive thank you to everybody who tuned in. Um, everybody who voted in the poll, 75% of you said Liverpool will win, 12% for a draw, 12% for a Fulham win. So thanks for that. Thanks everybody who liked loads and loads of likes on Facebook, shares as well, and some follows as well. Really appreciate that, guys. And also on YouTube, there was a couple of likes. If you haven't already, please do like the video. And also hit that subscribe button. The subscribe button is the most important one. It's what helps me grow and gets my content out to even more people who will enjoy it. And thanks everybody who's already done that. So Liverpool win 3-1 and we go back joint top of the table for now. That's, that's all we can do is just grind out these wins, get these three points. So again, thanks everybody. I'll see you Wednesday live. Obviously, look out for my... I'll have three videos before then. There'll be the highlights of this. There'll be my preview for the Everton game. There'll be shitouts of the week as well on Monday. So, yeah, I'll see you then. And until then, hunt the fucking Reds.